Hi guys, Matt Tarrant here from Telt Carp, and over these last few months, I've been given the chance to try out this. The New Direction Bait Boat 2. It's a relatively compact, lightweight, and user-friendly bait boat, which doesn't break the bank. So let's go on to the key specs of this bait boat and why I like it so much. It's worth mentioning that there's actually two versions of the Bait Boat 2. You've got the standard model and you've also got the deeper version, which is the model that I've got right here. And that actually has a deeper Chirp Plus integrated within the Bait Boat itself. But I'll go over that in more detail a little later in the video. So as I mentioned, it's a relatively compact and lightweight Bait Boat, weighing in at roughly five and a half kilos. As you can see, it's got this lovely sleek design with a carbon fiber effect finish on there. Then up front, you've got two bright headlights while at the rear you've got two rear lights as well so you can see the orientation of your bait boat and also those rear lights indicate which direction your boat's actually turning as well as showing you when your boat's reversing. In the centre of the bait boat you've then got two hoppers which take up to three kilos of bait which is really quite impressive considering the compact size of the bait boat and then you've also got an independent rear hook here which you can mount your rig on and drop your rig independently of the bait from the hoppers. The bait boat's powered by twin propulsion engines at the rear, which can run for approximately four miles, which is plenty of power there for your session. So then moving on from the bait boat itself is the handset, which is a feature that I really, really like of this bait boat. And that's because it's designed for single handed use. Now that means you can actually hold your rod and feather that line as you're controlling the bait boat. You can then open the hopper, feel it led down on a semi-tight line to ensure that your rig's not tangled or anything, feel it drop down and you know that your rig's gonna be presented. So on the handset itself, the movement of the bait boat is operated by this easy to use joystick. Simply push it forward, the bait boat goes forward, pull it back, the bait boat goes back, left, right, and also everything in between. So you can really control your bait boat with precision accuracy with just your single thumb. Then you've got a number of buttons on here. You've got the home and hook button, so you hold that down and it will release the hook and we'll get onto the home part in a little bit. You then got the on off button, which also operates the lights. So a quick click of that turns those headlights on and you can turn them off again. So then below that, you've got A and H1, H1 being hopper one, and that's the hopper on the left. You then got B and H2, which is hopper two, the hopper on the right. You then got C and D as well. So the A, B, C, D and home button are all for use with the autopilot function, which can be purchased through the app. However, it's worth mentioning that it can be used as a standalone bait boat as I've been using it without that autopilot function. So speaking of the app, it's actually a really cool feature to have anyway, even without the autopilot. Now the autopilot simply means that once you've registered spot A out in the lake, you can simply press A and the boat will drive itself out to that spot and then you can press home and it will drive itself back again. But you can actually register those spots in the app yourself thanks to the GPS that's built within the bait boat. So although you won't be able to drive it with simply the click of a button, you'll still be able to control the boat and see its location on the map even at night so that you can know that you can get your bait back on that spot. Now again, this is really useful when used in conjunction with that deeper Chirp Plus sonar, which is integrated within the boat itself. So that deeper Chirp provides a really high resolution sonar image of the water column wherever you're driving your boat. So you get a really good understanding of the lake bed and anything that's in the water column, including things like weed or even fish. So the Bait Boat 2 has got a range of roughly 200 meters, but obviously that's gonna be depending on the environmental conditions around you. But 200 meters is plenty of range for most waters that you're gonna come across in the UK. So there you go, that's the new direction, Bait Boat 2, and this is the deep model. For more information, head over to the New Direction website, newdirectiontackle.co.uk.